डाउनलोड तरंग ऑनलाइन रेडियो ऐप फ्रॉम गूगल प्ले स्टोर आप सुन रहे हैं तरंग डिवोशनल आध्यात्म से जुड़े In the Modern Art Gallery in New Delhi, today there is an exhibition on River Project, which is on the Yamuna River Project. And with us is Blanca de la Torre. She is the curator of the project. Let's find out what inspired her to get this uh, Yamuna River Project up and running. Uh, though she has also a uh, Giuliani Corey, Korean his artist, he is ill because he has been traveling along the Yamuna River and this is what one can say that how polluted Yamuna River is and how important it is to clear the Yamuna River for the livelihood, for the, uh, for the existence of humanity around the river who survive on the river. Uh, Branka, congratulations for, for this project. What inspired you for this project and what was the idea behind this project, if you may uh, mm -hmm. a a explain a little bit? Thank you. Yes, of course. Uh, well, basically, Juan Le Carrion, the artist, and myself, we have been working together for more like than 10 years. And we both are very interested in, in the relationship between art and ecology and, and art and sustainability. Basically, we believe that art is a very important tool to uh, show the ecological problematics of the present time. So on this occasion, well, uh, the Yamuna River is one of the most polluted uh, rivers in the planet. And the, also the embassy of Spain is, is um, deeply involved in, in, in this uh, problematic of the river. So they commissioned us this, this project and we decided that we would do a 10 day trip along the Yamuna with those 10 stops and that we would make, yes, we can see the, the map here. So the red spots are the different stops that we made. And we were making the work on each stop uh, using uh, um, uh, uh, textile dyeing, uh, which are uh, pH sensitive. Uh, meaning that uh, you know that the, the level of uh, pollution of the water changes the acidification of it, so it changes the pH. So uh, using the dye, in, in this case natural food derived dye, uh, which was actually mother root, um, mixed with the water, with the water of each of the stages, uh, we notice we notice that it changes the color, it changes the tones of red. So the resulting piece is like this mosaic that we can see on this side, where it shows that 10 stages. So where you can see how, depending on each stage, the tones of red color are totally changing, actually. This is the, the area like closer to Delhi. And this is Allahabad, the last stop. What is less polluted? So you, you see like this almost like berry color. That means that it's a pH 7. So it's like the least, least polluted area. So it's very interesting like how, you know, like the whole mosaic works almost like a graphic, you know, that shows different levels of pollution along the whole route. As they say, a picture speaks a million words. Exactly, exactly. You're so right. And I think, yeah, I think if we join the symbolic and the scientific parts, uh, you can give a much stronger, you know, view of the, you know, the current uh, extreme situation that we are facing right now. When do you think that your your research will uh, finish, and when you think that you're, you you'll be able to come up with some concrete plans or or the findings from the work that you are currently sowing grass in? 
Uh huh. Well, like the funding, the findings are here already. I think you know, like that that part is here, but we are still going to be working on this a uh, few months, and also we would like to show the work in different places in India. So we are still like planning to see how to, you know, travel the project to other areas in India to also, you know, like show how important it is to, you know, like give attention to the Yamuna River. And more important, what is important is the, the awareness that has to be developed and awareness that has to be uh, brought into. Is that what you said? Sociologies, ecologies also include sociology. It also includes political motivation by the people who are in power to make it happen. And I guess the, the, with the crowd and with yeah. the people who are there today, I think you have achieved your goal as some sort of creating awareness for us in Delhi, though we know about the problem, acuteness of the problem, but now you have proved with these red uh, pH scale, and that is that proves on in its own. Uh huh. Exactly. Well, I I really think we all have to take responsibility on it, and exactly as as you mentioned, like from the political level to any citizen and any citizen in the world. Like also, like ecological problems are not local; they are always global. Like we are all responsible for them. It doesn't matter where you live, you know, we all live in the same planet. Download Tarang online radio app from Google Play Store. You are listening to Tarang Devotional Online Radio.